Hello and welcome to Let's Play Mega Man X3 with Zegjita. We just beaten uh, Bitten Bites Fusion Form. Bite. Uh, Beata? I don't freaking care. Anyway, we're going to the second stage now. And remember how I said we wanted to fight um, Vile because it would make it easier? Well, apparently I'm a moron, because I had the weakness needed to make it easier, yet I didn't use it, and therefore I have to fight Vile again. Great, isn't it? Now, if this guy would come down... Damn it. Let's be a moron about this, huh, Zeg? Alright. We're doing a very good job of it. Which is really kind of sucky, because in my practice run, I didn't do this badly. I mean, I didn't do great. If Think about it. If I'm doing practice runs, then think how, <laughs> how badly my other videos would have been if I hadn't. Oh, man. Now, here you get right armor, but I don't quite understand it, because I try to do it, Oh well. We're gonna grab it anyway, it's some easy kills. And I thought I could break that wall open, but I apparently can't, so we're going up. And up we go! Now, I don't understand why there's a door here, because nothing happened in here. I don't know, maybe it's just something you do if you beat Vile, or... Or, uh, if Zero's dead or something. I really don't know, to be honest. Not off the top of my head, I don't. Now, th No, we're not quite there yet. I thought we were at this really annoying part, but we're not yet. Come on, die, 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 die. I'm not too worried about taking damage, at least. Not against these things. Against those crabs, I might be a little... Here we go. Now, this is annoying because you have to use these crabs, or snails, I guess, to go up. What's cool is if I stand still, I get health, so... Which wouldn't be so bad if I only had to use one snail, but I'm going to have to use several. And I lagged. That was such a horrible time to lag. I have no idea why I decided to lag me right then. At the one part I would rather have not lagged. Out of this whole game, there's only a few places I wouldn't mind lag, and... That wasn't one of them. Wait, did I say that right? Whatever. But that's why I'm not worried about taking damage, because I'm more worried about this part over here, where it's instant kill. <sighs> you definitely don't want to get hit back into him. All right, there we go. Safe and sound. Whew, there's much harder ones to jump than that, though. Which wouldn't be, again, too bad if I wasn't lagging at this point. Get virtually no lag through the whole thing, and then the lag at this point? It's not, it's not cool. I don't think I need to change snails. Ah, that's why they want you to change. Alright, well it doesn't matter. 
I'd rather just go up here and not have to worry about it. And there we go. And now we just need to ride it up here. And here we are. I think we're at Vile now. I think we are anyway. It's weird they put this extra room in here. It's almost like a trick. Like there's nothing in here. At least I don't think there's anything there. Let's climb up here to make sure. Yeah, there's just this empty room here. It's like they decided that they were going to put something there and that they didn't. So I don't know. But here's Vile. Oh, crap. Um, My waiting has finally come to an end. Prepare to die at the hands of the world's most advanced riding armor. The new Goliath. We're going to switch to um, Tornado Fang. I forgot that he's not... I don't know if his weakness is the Tornado Fang, but it seems to work the best. Please don't lag on me. This is not a good place to lag. Not that it's... This fight's pretty easy. In all honesty, as, as long as you're not being a moron. I'm pressing the dash button a lot. Come on, come. The dash button's gonna be worn out after this fight. And you might get a little anxious here, but you have one more fight to go, so it's best to just play it safe. And now we'll switch to Ray Splasher, which is his technical weakness. Now I'm probably going to have to use an energy tank here, but we want to try and save it as much as possible. If he grabs onto you, that's when you're in trouble. All right, we're gonna use an energy tank to be safe, since we can replenish it after each after each one of these. You can replenish your sub tanks, or hell, you can just stand still for about three minutes and replenish it. I'm gonna show the charged up version of this, though. It's kind of cool. It should do a few good hits on him, like that. Don't think that this is the end, X. I will haunt you to the day you D-I-E die. Dot, 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 dot. Boom. Not unless you have a backup file, bitch. Which I'm going to make sure of that later, hopefully. That would be a smart thing to do. And that's the second stage of Doppler's Lair. It's always great to finish that up. Now then, next is the third one, but we're going to wait for the next video for that. Anyway, that's been Let's Play Mega Man X3 with Zegjita. Thanks for watching.